Hi everyone, I am Jose Masheri. So this is the scene we are going to key out today. If you take a look at the footage, you can see the screen is unevenly lit. This part is very bright and if you come to the floor, it's very dark and it's noisy too. In this case, especially when the character is moving, it's better to use a clean plate. A clean plate means the background without the character. Now let's go to the fusion page. Click on this icon here. Now right click on the footage here. Save image. And I am going to call this clean plate. Select PNG and save. Now let's go to our footage. Go to the fusion page here. First thing we have to add a noise reduction node to reduce the noise. To do that, click on the media in. Press shift spacebar and search for noise reduction. Now go to the inspector window here. I'm going to change this to 5, faster from better. Here you can adjust the Luma chroma threshold separately if you uncheck this. I'm going to increase the Luma threshold a bit and I'm going to increase the chroma threshold like so. If you turn this off, you can see the grains. If you turn this on, you can see it's a clean image now. Select the noise reduction node, press shift spacebar and search for delta here. Now it's time to bring our clean plate to the node system here. I have my clean plate PNG here. Just click and drag. Right click and drag to the delta key here. Here select clean plate. Now click on the delta key here and press 2 on the keyboard to preview the node. Go to the inspector window and increase the blue level here. If you click on this icon here you can see the alpha mat. As you can see without doing much we have a pretty good key here. Now let's refine the key. First, go to the balance slider here to get the nice balance between the black and white. Somewhere over here. Now let's go to the matte settings here and increase the threshold. The white thresholds here. Now you can adjust these sliders without uh, without losing any details. Slightly. As you can see, there are many unwanted pieces here. Let's draw a garbage mat to get rid of them. To do that, go to the polygon mask here and draw a polygon mask. Like that. Right click and drag to the delta key here. Here select garbage mat. Now go to the inspector and invert the mask. Now I am going to add a background to see how the key looks. So let's bring it to the upside here. Get a solid color. And I am going to change the solid color to a lighter gray color. So any imperfections will be visible here. As you can see, it's a pretty good key now. If you want to refine the key, you can make more adjustments and you can add more polygon masks to mask out other unwanted pieces if remains. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.